Dear friends, in this video, I am going to create an object which contains a field and a method. To create an object, first we need to define a class. A class is like a blueprint for creating object. It describes what is our object. Object is a usable instance of a class which contains both instructions and data. Both are optional, but it can combine both and it is called as encapsulation. In our program, we are going to have a field and method in our object. Field is like a variable which can hold some information, whereas method is some action that can be performed by our object. Our class is person. We are going to store information of a person and hence the name. To create an object, it is good to write its uh, uh, visibility and uh, keyword used for creating our class is class keyword and we will end our class definition with end class we will have a field named name this field is going to store person's name its visibility is public and its data type is string and hence we will write this line name as string we will also have a method which is show. It is not going to return any value, hence it is not a function. It is a sub procedure. Sub procedures are declared with the keyword sub, and sub procedures definition ends with end sub. This sub procedure is going to display our uh, field name, and hence we will have this line console dot write line name. We have seen how to define a class. Now, how to instantiate it? To instantiate it, first we need to declare it. This part, left hand side part, is declaration. Dim p as person. Here p is the object variable name and person is the type of this variable. This variable is going to hold an instance of a class, person. And here in the right hand side, we are creating or we are instantiating a new object. To instantiate a new object, we are going to use keyword new. New person. If there is a constructor, that will be invoked using this call. Now the P object is ready. New object is created and it is assigned to object reference variable P. And now we can access P to uh, store a uh, field value or to uh, execute a method. Now let us see this in Visual Studio. Here we have our class definition inside module and we have submain and inside submain we are going to create and uh, uh, I mean instantiate uh, our object and access its field and method and uh, at the end we have included a console.read line so that we can hold the output window now let us run this this is going to display output Srinidhi this output is because we have assigned Srinidhi as a value for our field name and this was the object instantiated and we have displayed that uh, field in show the procedure as you have seen this is how a console project looks like we have added our class definition here and then we have uh, instantiated object here happy programming and thank you for watching